Hi, I'm Skyler. Let's say you want to restore your iPhone without updating it. This is kind of uncommon. If you didn't have an internet connection or you wanted to stay at your current level of software, those are a couple different reasons you would do it. But let's not talk so much about the why, let's just stick to the how. So, first of all, trusty sync cable, connect your iPhone to your computer. I'm going to do this tutorial on a Mac. Once your phone is connected to your computer, you should see it appear in iTunes. In iTunes, you'll see the summary page and oh, aperture open, sorry. You'll see the summary page and underneath that, you'll see version, check for update, or restore. If you click restore, it's going to reach out to Apple servers, try and get new software, yada, yada, yada. So just hold down option and click restore. But first, go to Spotlight and type in terminal. Apple has decided in operating systems 10.7 and 10.8 to hide the library folder. This is kind of important because it's the place where we need to navigate to in a second. So open your terminal window and type in this command. You see it a couple times, I've entered it. ch flags no hidden tilde forward slash library. Return. That's it. Quit terminal and go back over to iTunes. Hold down Option, click Restore, and navigate to your Users folder under your hard disk. Your user, keep scrolling down, find Library, scroll down a little bit more, eventually you'll find iTunes. Open up iTunes, and here we go. We see iPhone software updates, yada, yada, yada. So click iPhone software updates. And in this folder, click open. You'll find the necessary updates. I actually don't have any downloaded to my computer, so <laughs> it won't work here. But you'll see the version of the software that you had last downloaded to your computer. So you just click it here, click open, and then iTunes would install that version of the software onto your iPhone. That's it. Thanks a lot. I'm Skyler.